Okay, guys, we are back with another video. First NHL 20 video, and it will be the start of the franchise mode series. With the team, with the team that you guys all voted for, that got them, you know, uh, f you know, the team that won. You're you're going to see it right now here. So as you see here, if you see continue load new, I tried the franchise mode features and stuff like that. It's phenomenal. Okay, I, I was just trying it out myself. So. Uh, the team we all picked. Okay, classic. I didn't do any custom roster. Okay, GM name. We all know. We all know the name I'm known for as a GM. So we will uh, go with that. So the team we will pick is. Drum roll. Drum roll. Drum roll. The Ottawa Senators. So, <laughs> you guys voted for that team. Dumpster fire. And it's time. For, well, I led the, the the Devils and the and the Kings. Two teams who were bad teams to the, to a Stanley Cup win. An 81 overall team. How bad is that? So, I think it might take a while to rebuild that team. So, first of all, owner mode off because I want to sign the number of coaches I want and stuff like that. And this off, Fog of War is on because why not? It shows how it is to be a real GM in the NHL, bro. Okay. So, start career. Salary cap on. Uh, rules and settings. Rules and settings. Maybe I may have some sliders, but I'm just going to leave it to pro. And first thing we're gonna do here is turn injuries off. Okay, just saying. Put injuries off only for year one. Because I wanna go by it fast. This episode, this first episode, I wanna go to the trade deadline. And I don't want it to be taking forever. Okay, so uh settings rules this wait a sec i'm gonna okay injuries off but also the scouting wait a sec i want to see like the auto scout uh playable fully healed first of all like when i will have minors injury fully healed to auto save on why not that uh various points in the season maybe that on so that uh auto coach management auto scouting both okay good uh, owner mode, apparently time scout is scaling. I don't know about that. Uh, trade difficulty medium. And also the trade finders and stuff like that. So, <laughs> this will be uh, an interesting thing to do, you know. I, I think I will use that more than just, uh, wait a sec. Regular season, let's just sim to that and I already have a trade offer. No thanks for Leo Komarov. No thanks for... Paul Byron, mate, wait a sec, should I accept that trade? They're interested in trading for Paul Byron, he's 30 years old. Is he a scheme fit? Wait a sec, is he a scheme fit? How do we see that? Wait a sec. Bro, I'm, I'm already lost. Four years, bro. It, it, it might end up bad. You know, he's gonna. Be, he might be good at in the first line with like the scheme fit, but you know, first of all, Mark Borowiecki. It, like I haven't even set up my my training block. First of all, l let's see the coaching staff because one thing I want the co a head coach that is good at teaching. Okay, A plus teaching. This is good. This is very good. So, how many of these guys fit fit the scheme? Oh, okay. This is good. So, first of all, uh, do, do we have to set up his strategies? Wait a sec. Do we have to manually set up his strategies? Because if we have to, this is uh, a bit... Oh, my God. Okay. I think it's already set up. 
I think it has to be already set up automatically. So, first of all, let's go on free agents, first of all. Let's just sign some guys here. Uh, Vanek. We can bring back for enough, but no no thanks. Uh, Dan Girardi might be something good. But let's see what we have here. Smith Pelly. We might just need guys for only this year. So, maybe sign Devontae Smith Pelly and Oscar Lindbergh. Just these two guys. Uh, wait a sec. Uh, I want to also sign. Uh, who else already? Patrick Marlowe. Oh wait, I do not even have. Uh, oh wait a sec. Never mind. I I cannot. I only have one uh, roster spot left. So let's check the team here. Oh my God. I hope I don't get disappointed. Well. Okay, so we have some young guys. First of all, what we're gonna do? Never mind. There, there's that line chemistry thing here. Uh, this might not even be good. Well, this no might end up bad. No. No. Oh my God, this team is so bad. I swear, this team is so bad. Like literally, you have no chemistry between anyone in this team. I swear. Gary, there's Drake Batterson there. Maybe we can... I think this year, it's we're better off using Alex Formentin. These guys. Okay, so first thing we're going to do... Well, we have a coach who is good at teaching. So, we should maybe get these guys to grow. Also, Wolanin, he's what... What age is he? Uh, I can't see the age here. Okay, wait a sec. 24 years old could use him Alex Formentin and yeah that's that's all Logan Brown and all these guys are just gonna stay there so Brandstrom too is gonna is gonna be uh, is, is not gonna be there too so these guys are gonna be sent down Gabrick yeah Gabrick we, we can maybe ship his contract out that's what I will try to do. First of all, let's go on trading block. I'm a bit disorganized here, but... Okay, Gabrick. Tyler Ennis. Let's take him off and just put... Uh, oh my god, who has a pretty bad contract, bro? Who has a bad contract? Of course, Bobby Ryan. Uh, it's paid... Bro, bro Wiki, he's what? He's 30 years old... We can maybe afford to keep his contract. You know why? Because he's not he's not overpaid. Okay. Uh, Nikita Zaitsev might need. Yeah, we might. Bro, look, look at these contracts. Why is Ron Hazy getting paid three mil? Like, what is that? What is that contract? I'm putting Zaitsev in there because Zaitsev has literally a bad contract, very bad contract. Okay, like, very bad. Four, uh, like, bro. Lula Moriello. <laughs> oh, my God. And one thing that's very dumb. Zaitsev only played one year for the Maple Leafs. And, and he got signed to that contract. How disappointing is that? Wait a sec. Let's uh, put... We have to play Colin, Colin White. Okay, we have to play him. Face-offs. I'm pu putting the guy with better face-offs. Okay, never mind. He's going to play on the wing here. Drake Batterson. These guys have to dev have to be developing. Uh, no, Mikel Bodker. Connor Brown. Okay, this is a plus one, minus one there. Yeah, I did... Some of these guys just aren't really scheme fits. Well, at least... Never mind. I'd rather have just that than just... Okay, defense. Ooh, okay. I like what I see here. I really like what I see. Okay, plus three overall. They're... Especially the first pair. But still, Zaitsev has a bad contract. It stays the same here. Oh, no. And here, Craig Anderson. And 
out there we need 83 overall what's his contract uh his contract is where yes oh his contract expires this year we could maybe use him to move move around we we need some cap space in order to actually get some young guys okay he rejected for the red wings while well, first come first serve okay smith pelly i actually got one of them let's just uh start the sim here when you go to the oh yeah scouts first of all first of all the scouts shl yes this is good usa west the hl scouts just saying J just for you guys hey i'm an elite gm here the ahl scouts are useless so just fire them and we have it's and we're better off like that okay i don't care if he's a minus we need scouts for other regions and hl north that too and i don't think there's owner mode off on so i don't know why it says scout salary when we just do not need okay wait a sec we don't need we, we do not even have like all the all the usa okay usa west usa east isn't there like usa pacific is there usa pacific isn't there that wait a sec usa pacific isn't there usa Pac no never mind never mind so russia we can maybe use a, a scout in the whl and the ohl this might be good whl he's a he's an a scout this is good here we want these good scouts who, who are capable of doing their job. Uh, OHL. I'm gonna take that. He's also pretty good in the in the QAJ, in QMJHL. So this is uh, this is nice to see that. We could use another QMJHL scout. So you know, we'll get more information into uh, into co into uh, players. So this is good. Okay. This is good here. We have another scout signed. We will use... Oh, we only have two USA scouts. I think it's only USA East and USA West. We only have, right? Wait a sec. What is wrong? USA Central. That's what I, I was missing. Okay, that Ellison guy. You just got to remember. I'm going to send him to USA Central. Okay. Uh, we will need another one. We will need a... It, okay, never mind. We we got one there. Russia, we will use that here. Russia's where B. He's a B scout in Russia. He's an A minus scout in Russia. A plus. I'm taking him. You know. Okay. So these are all the scouts that are signed here. First. Okay. So guys, I'm bringing you guys back when we sign the scouts. Okay, okay. Just to remember that Ellison guy has to be sent to USA Central. Okay, all these guys sign. Okay, good. Okay. Let's go on a sign scout. And let's go on US. Okay, Ellison. Let's go on, uh, on you there. Well, of course, you have to find prospects. Uh, oh, okay, it's already USA Central. Uh, how many... Okay, you're up. One scout active. Rest of the world. We might need one in the rest of the world. Okay, we will assign another scout to rest of the world here. So that... So that at least we'll have scouts all over the world now. If we... If we actually have these... These scouts. So, wait a sec. Who's good in the rest of the world? Like, I, I could take any of them. Just saying. Uh, e. Probably someone who's like in Scandavia okay, or, or something like that. Uh, maybe in Russia. They might be good, these guys. B. This is okay, but not not, not what I'm looking for. He's A in the rest of the world. A+. Plus. I'm, uh, I'm taking this guy. I'm taking this guy. 
I'm just saying, I don't know why it says, uh, well, I think it will just say it, but we don't have any owner mode. So, there's just no point of that. Lost luck room chemistry after only two games. Vico, okay. Let's just uh, bring you to your uh, SHL. No, change region. We have no scouts there. We will need that. Yeah, select. I think we have to pay. Oh, like, if I had owner mode, I had to pay for the hours too. So, wait a sec. Also, I forgot to send up uh, Devontae Smith Pelly. <laughs> he needs to be in. Anyway, we can send him in without sending anyone back, so. This is all good. And we will just do best lawns, and after that, we uh, we fix that. Look at that chemistry. <laughs> Top notch. Okay. Uh, Colin White, you're not playing in the... in. Okay. Wait a sec. Let's see him, first of all, because it says if he's better... He's better off in the fourth line. But it won't work here. Like, it, it doesn't... It just doesn't work. I, he cannot be on the... On the... On the fourth line. I'm not... This is not even happening. 70 face-offs, bro. <sighs> Who has better face-offs than this? 60. 65. You're going on center. Uh, Peugeot. Okay. It makes the chemistry better. Okay. Minus three. These guys are like all minus threes. The fourth line will not do good, looks like. Will this do better? Well, yeah, because it's Colin White, but I don't want him to, Like, honestly, I really just don't want him to play there, but if it's going to make things better, just why not? No, okay. You know, like, what I want to do is just keep my players happy, okay? So that... Uh, you know like the coach I have here will stay the coach for pretty much the rest you know like the teaching the coach che teaching needs to be there in order for prospects to grow because he's capable of teaching them you know like some Mike Babcock Mike Babcock type of guy well we will need Alexi Lafreniere so uh, we will pin him because we need him. Scout the player. Who's better? You know, uh, potential in comparison. I I know it's too it's too soon, but we're literally tanking for him. Okay, like in the first few years, we're gonna be tanking for first overall. Tyler Ennis for two-thirds this will make sense since we're trying to uh, just you know why not that trade and we just traded Tyler Ennis for third for two-thirds and what I've realized too the menus are faster the sim engine is is better like uh, it's faster even with injuries so this is a good thing they did uh, thanks what should we do trade for someone over 30 we have Ron Hainsey yeah we have to trust the process okay okay so maybe we will need but you know he's gonna take the place for our young guys you know, like honestly, also I don't think he's. I don't think Ryan Callahan is is scratched. He's supposed to be scratched. Colin White leading the team with 11 points in 15 games. Very good to see that. Drake Batterson is here, so this is good. Okay, this this will make things worse. Well, it makes things equal, so if a Kachuk is going to play on the second line, this is good here. 
No, Miko. Um, Bobby Ryan, you're going on the third line. I think it's either that or not. Okay, so. So, uh, you know, Colin White, if you're gonna. Like, I don't wanna play on. Play him on the. On the fourth line. If he's producing, even with that. You know, if he's getting fourth line. Yeah, also, Drake Batterson, we're going to put you up there. Playing on the third line. Just saying, we need we need to get these guys ice time, okay? So, and Alex Formentin, we will put you up there instead of Callahan. You know, it's it's a year where we just need that. We, we just need these. Oh look, he's giving a boost. Oh uh, yeah, it, well it's gonna be better for now, okay? So, wait a sec. Oh. Okay, good, 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 very good. Honestly, I don't really care. We will lose games. We're tanking. Okay, we're we're, we're literally tanking for first overall. Everything is okay. Okay. Okay, we're losing games. We're winning some too. Seven eleven and okay. Big weaker than normal. It's not even the real draft class, you know. For for the next franchise mode, that's going to be probably later on. We we just need to. We will indeed need to make create some players, but you know, uh, there's this guy Maxwell Leach, who is supposed to be. Good. We'll scout him. Potential. Let's get this guy. Uh. Alexander Holtz. He. I. I don't think he's a. He's a creative player. He's a real player. I think. Maybe. But. Let's sign. Like, I think we will need a first rounder by, like, some team that actually just sucks. You know, so, yeah. We will need a... And also the... Uh, and also the scoring. I'm gonna test it, see if, uh, if I'll need to put, put it on, uh, on high. I'm not taking Brett Connolly's contract like literally four years at three mil. He doesn't. He, he's like a fourth liner, bro. No thanks for Zach Cassian either. I don't need Zach Cassian. I just need to just trust the process here and then just go on with it. So, just saying, I'm not firing the coach at all. Coach isn't going anywhere unless he wants to leave. But other than that, he's not. He's not going anywhere. Uh, lack of scoring. Lack of scoring. <laughs> we need more time, bro. We have a weak team. You know, we, we just need. We just need to. Like, honestly, I'm not really agreeing with what he's doing, but I'm persuading, you know? I'm not... It's not hurting his morale at all. Yes, per fast. Will this make things... It's making things pretty interesting. Uh, I'm not giving him the force. 80 overall at 29 years old. Is he, like, a... Uh, one year left in his $1 million contract? Pff, never mind. Like, what I'm actually trying to trade, it's not really Mark Burrow weak. I don't know why people actually want him. Like, honestly, th this is weird. This is very weird. Extremely weird. Because we're not supposed to be having that. Start upset. Even my 
my skills can't even solve this problem. Whoa, okay. Okay, he's losing that much morale. Oh, no. We will need to trade for, for, for a veteran, but... Okay, we need to go get Patrick Marlowe. We will need to go get Patrick Marlowe. Okay, I think I went too far with him. He's on the Red Wings, so... <coughs> Not going to be hard to find here. Because it said the team was going to s sign with instead. So, first of all... Where is, uh... There's more cider there. We can maybe use him. Uh, okay. Fine trade. Excuse me, you're not going to... You're... Bro, they do not even want to trade... What? You know what? Just propose a trade. And just let's... And negotiate the whole thing here, okay? So, first of all, let's go in for the... Okay. Okay, let's just uh, trade it. Maybe trade like a... Uh... Wait a sec. Whoa, 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 where is... Wasn't there Clark McCarter there? Okay, Schlappick is actually doing good. Formentin, I don't know about him. Maybe he's doing good. Okay, he's doing okay. 17, po 17 points. Uh, Bowser's is doing okay. Uh, I don't really need to give up a prospect. And we have two first rounders, which will be maybe good. Uh, maybe like two six to. Uh, Two six rounders will will do it. Okay, a fifth and a sixth. Like honestly, I really do not need. He has one year left. I only need it for a year. Okay, I, I just need it for a year. He's gonna be okay. Okay, fifth fifth rounder. No. I I don't know what's the problem here. Maybe Adam Bobby Ryan. Maybe. It will open some uh, some opportunities for other guys. He has eight points. Maybe add these guys. Disapproved. Okay, just giving a a, a a random guy here. Okay, just just a random guy. Just like this N guy. Why not that? Not liking it. Maybe this, or maybe just that. Okay, just add in this. Are you actually kidding me? Well, they're not trying to trade him. They're really not trying to trade him, but here's the thing here. The, the only reason, wait a sec, the team is... Look, it's all good here. I don't know why there is a lack of scoring. Drake Batterson is actually growing, which is a very good thing. We'll need to trade some guys here. On defense, probably Zaitsev, it, it depends. Okay, like it depends what I can get for him. Okay, if I can get something good for Zaitsev, some good value, like maybe fleece a, a team. It's good, okay? But other than that, just find a trade here. Okay, there is some trades. Chris Kreider. We could get Chris Kreider. He has a five-year contract. Just rem just a reminder. Uh, can we get a first? Because the Rangers are supposed to be good. Well, they're not. Kreider is what? Like, maybe I would like to retain some salary here. And then, like, no thanks, bud. Like I said before, it depends what we get for him. You know? So, there's our Temi Panera in there. Uh, what I'm trying to do is just get, like, a first or a second. Maybe a second and a third, maybe. 
Well, this, not even this will work. So maybe let's see what we can get for for Bobby Ryan. Maybe. Uh, first let's see Ron Hainsey and oh, we can get something for one. Okay, only Matthew Perro. <sighs> for Ryan Callahan. Wait a sec, let's go on, uh, yeah, Ron Haynes, he, we can get something for these guys, we can get something, uh, let's see for him, oh, Ryan Callahan, we can get something for him, we can get Mike Condon back, other than that, nothing else, oh, wait a sec, he's not even, he's nothing, Wait a sec. Will, will Greg McKegg even be better than him? Because if he is going to be better than him, then why not? 27. <sighs> you know what? Like, he will decline. So maybe his value is going to be to nothing. So let's just do that trade now. Because, yes, I've been thinking about it. Being like, uh... He will not, he will not be really something, like it won't really affect anything, because look at his contract, but no trades found. Ah, uh, Bobby Ryan, we will have to, we will have to find a way to ship that contract out, because his value is going to, can only get worse, okay, yes he's in any one overall. But he's not producing for his contract. Okay. So. Nick Bonino. Let's see what is with that. It depends how Bonino is. 31 years old. Yes we need. Oh my god, maybe if we retain a bit of salary, like, I think I can take his contract, I can maybe take his contract, but maybe just have less money, and then this goes through, no, okay, it's literally, the idea of retaining salary even just, you know what, it, just put it, put it as it is, First of all, we have two firsts and two seconds for next year, which is good. We will, at least we listen to the coach, actually. So, Nikita Zaitsev for... The reason why the trade would be bad for me, because it's Alex Steen. It's Alex Steen, and he's 35 years old. Maybe if I can take this, we can maybe take another player. Another player other than uh, maybe a defenseman. Like, uh, I'd rather take a defenseman, like a one for one defenseman trade, technically. Maybe. Is this guy going to be good? Nico Mikola. Will he be. Uh, he's not scouted yet. Trade block, uh, block availability. He's, he has one year left. He's minor def defenseman, but if he has more value, let's see his stats. 17 points in 46 games, but that's in the AHL. Uh, Jay Boomy's third. There's Joel Edmondson, maybe, we can take. We can, I would afford taking this contract. This won't even go through. So maybe a defenseman with, l with less value, maybe. Because one thing, sooner or later, I would want to get rid of that stupid contract by, uh, you know, because this is just annoying to see that. Like, literally, I'm just seeing how Pierre Dorian is just effing up his team. Like, completely. Completely effing up that team. Literally, just because of one goal. Just because of one goal. Just saying, you could have even just, after that bad season, you, you know what, just, I'm not taking Alex Steen's contract, okay, like, no, it's not getting taken, just maybe lose some more games, no thanks, I'm not taking Travis Zajac, uh, there, like, 
they're proposing that because they're saying I need a veteran guy, but I already have Nick Bonino, who's over 30 years old. So I literally listened to the coach sooner or later, even even if I pissed him off a little. Uh, it will be time to just make some trades. We need to make our team worse. We just need to we need to tank for Lafreniere. First, we're gonna keep these guys. We're, like other than that, okay, Drake Batterson, you're going there. Yes, good. We have to find a way to just ship Anisimov. Bodker, Bodker, is he good? Uh, 26 points. Maybe have some value in the thing there. Like he won't, he won't be. You know what? 4.2 for a year. I can keep him for the rest of the year. It could be good. Smith Pelly, I don't really mind keeping him. Like if I have to include him in the trade, I will. Uh, Colin White, you're going to get promoted to the first line. Uh, other than that, Brady Kachuk, you're staying staying there. Uh, Craig Anderson, let's see with Craig Anderson. He has one year left too. He can maybe just stay with us. But if not, who will we who will we have as goalie? Like we will have to pick up someone in the in the market. Okay. So, you know, let me know in the comments. Subscribe if you're new. Click the like button. Comment down below. What should I trade? Who, for what should I trade? Like, who should I trade? And for what price? Okay. So, first of all, let's sim to this. And then we're going to wrap up the episode here. So... Like I said before, Pierre Louis Belmar, I, I'm not taking that because I won't have any defense after that. Ooh, okay. Derek Brassard and Dan Girard got traded for two seconds and a 63 overall goaltender. Okay, New Jersey probably. I don't think they're even rebuilding. Maybe. I don't think they're they're going for a playoff spot there. So let me know in the comment section what should I do. Click the like button, subscribe. You know, click the bell to enable notifications. And yeah, guys, I'll see you guys in the next episode where we will finish the season with the Ottawa Senators.